So, ADHD, autism, and what is the Amir Khan's movie? What is the Amir Khan's movie of uh, Challenger Children? Hare huh? Zami Par. You will remember. Huh? What is it? Hare? Hare Zami Par. Is what you are going to remember in the tomorrow's APPG. Autism ADHD. You must know what age you define, what is the DSM definition of autistic, autistic disorders, everything, confidently. Very good. 164, it should not be explained by any other disorder. Symptoms should, cannot be secondary to any other disorder before you qualify it as ADHD. Very good. A young man survived unharmed in a terror strike. It is called post traumatic stress disorder. You did not think of any other answer. It is not adjustment disorder. Why? After few months. Last entrance ke bare mein abhi bhi neend nahi aa rahe to. Isko bolte hai post traumatic stress disorder. Recent entrance ka mistakes ko soch ke ro rahe to. Isko bolte hai adjustment disorder. Hmm? Now, uh, how do you know? How is the rotation of the chest at the time of taking x-ray? Which feature you will examine to say that this is excessively rotated, this is normally rotated? How will you say? Very simple question. You will look at the clavicular head symmetry based on which you will basically decide. Edson's test is is what? Quick answer. Cervical rape. No second thought. Multiple sinuses and induration means we should think of TB or actinomycosis, thoracic actinomycosis, induration, multiple sinuses. Is typically actinomycosis. Then what are the basic rules of wound closure? Wound edges, can you leave it uh, gaping and yellow swelling? Never. They must be nicely approximated. But option B also is controversial in this. Edges should be inverted also is not what we do. We will only approximate it. We don't invert. So, A is correct as an answer. B is possibly correct considering a bad English eh, about inverting. Now, nutritional consequences of the peptic ulcer surgeries which you do. Uh, which one is uh, the consequence? There is a weight loss between B12 deficiency. Multiple answers are there in this. Another controversial answer. A, B, C. Even uh, a government board exam also there can be few 5 to 6 mistakes in the frame. Multiple answers possible. But don't imagine that uh, while answering exam. Answering exam, think that there is only one answer. Now, what can lead to osteomalacia? One confident answer, please. Yes. Osteomalacia is vitamin D deficiency. So, that is the reason. What can lead to the development of osteomalacia, doctor? Yes. Dietary deficiency, calcium deficiency, lack of exposure to sunlight, all of them. But indirectly gastrectomy. So, even C can also be responsible indirectly. So, little tricky frame. We don't know what examiner thought of it. Eh? Right. Vecuronium is, I think, simplest. What is sevoflurane? Inhalational. Vecuronium, muscle relaxant. Lidocaine, local anesthetic. That means anesthesia is easy subject. Examiner want to tell you. Huh? Then oral meiasis means what? Meiasis or meiasis, what do you call it? It is the megots in the ear is what you have to basically remember. Question number 173, very good. Then fetus typically lot position, left occipital transverse is the common way of presentation. 
then uh, perinatal transmission will reduce to how much if you are giving heart therapy huh? 30 or 2 already you are giving antiretroviral therapy then it will come down to 2% hence HIV pregnancy delivery management. What are the guidelines and statistics? Hundred percent, you have to be sure. Frequently asked question, right? Similarly, human papilloma virus vaccines is one question. You will remember me tomorrow when this question comes in the exam. Hundred percent, you have to be sure. Huh? Carpal bones mainly gives what stability to the wrist joint. Then. Whenever the oxygen is low, hypoxia. What is the response of systemic circulation? Vasodilatation. Response of pulmonary circulation is vasoconstriction. Hence, COPD patients with alveolar hypoxia will go into pulmonary vasoconstrictions and pulmonary hypertension in the long run. Now, doctor, Ecartibant is what kind of a drug? Have you heard of it? Ecartibant. There is a tendency between A and B. What is your answer? Chalo. B. You thought? Any other answer? Question number one seventy eight. We invite our online students to give an answer. So I am confident answer. Yes. Ecartibant. What do you want to propose? One seventy eight. Pahima, Tirupati, Nina, Amrita. I have to give one confident answer. I think most of them have gone for lunch. Yes. What is your online answer? Yes. It is an example of a bradykinin receptor blocker. Classically, Pahima correctly answered, but Tirupati said immunosuppressant. That Bant Bant is very very tempting to choose A. Huh? Then Flumazenil is cheapest question. Benzodiazepine antagonist. Then, uh, what is the so cause of the rejection? Both salinity and also humoral immunity. Then, C1 complement deficiency is called hereditary angioneurotic edema. Freshwater drowning may fresh water enters lungs, but the salinity of the plasma will drag that water into the blood, and the blood volume increases and puts a load on the heart. So, that's the reason. Answer is A. What is an odds ratio? Odds is basically risk factor and outcome ke beech mein association is spoken by the odds ratio. What is the false negative? What is meant by false negative? There is a neat PG but there is no result. He is false negative. There is a disease but the test is negative. Huh? So he is false negative. Platypnea means Typically, dyspnea in the upright or uh, supine position. Supine or uh, upright. Orthopnea. Orthopnea is dyspnea in the supine position, relieved by sitting forward. Right. So this is dyspnea in the upright position, which is relieved by the supine position. Then you call it as platypnea. Commonest cancer in male in India is what oral cavity, right? So D should be the answer, not B. So small correction. I also thought it is oral cavity. Now uh, hematological malignancy. Why do you want to do transplantation basically? So that you will give high dose of myelosuppressive therapy, extirpate the bone marrow, and then do the BMT. So that is the main purpose of it. In irritable bowel syndrome, hematochagia. If it is there, you have to evaluate. It is not more functional bowel disorder. You need to seriously take if hematochagia is there in the history. Now temper tantrums, hai to kya karega? If the child is beating all his classmates, his LKG teacher. Everyone, what will you want to do? It's a part of normal growth. It's a challenge to be grown. Psychologically easy. Subside by three to six years. No need of psychiatric consultation. Right? 
So, don't send the child for a psychiatric review. So, we need not do that.